Hi, I'm Lisa Peterson, the Department Manager of the Highway Engineering Group at the Mount Laurel Office of New Jersey. I'm here to do my Dewberry Explains on highway design. There's a few key things that we need to know. Uh, the classification of the road, is it a freeway that's the fast moving roadways, is it a collector road that uh, will move us from like our, our local towns to a major highway, or is it a local road that has, uh, has our schools and police stations and our homes uh, located on it? Uh, what where is it? Is it in a rural terrain or a urban terrain? You know, is it a nice open area? Or are we confined by pre-existing buildings uh, that we need to fit some uh, of our features in? Uh, the topography, again, is it mountainous? Is it flat? What other things exist in the area? Uh, any historical uh, locations? Are there other highways that we need to tie into? Are there railroads that we need to consider? Um, the traffic, uh, you know, vehicles, bikes, and pedestrians, what are their volumes, what's their level of service, uh, you know, we, those are other considerations that will help us with our later design features. Uh, vehicle type, are, are cars using it, are trucks using it, buses, each of them move differently than the other, and it's important to uh, know who's the majority user of, of that roadway. And then lastly, and uh, very importantly, is our speed. Uh, we have a posted speed that we should be abiding by, and then there's the design speed that us as the highway engineers, um, we would do our design by.